I have made an astonishing discovery in my life. And it's this. The Word of God brings breakthrough in our lives. I've experienced it firsthand. And I must say, it was clearly linked in my life to a, a wonderful moment when I realized that the Word of God is not just a Bible. It's actually a person. And that person is Jesus Christ. If you desire real breakthrough in your life, to see things change, to go to another level, to get out of your limitations, then I encourage you today to view the Word of God in a whole new light. To look at the Word as a person, the living Jesus Christ. And that you will begin to cultivate a relationship with the living Word, Jesus. It's amazing that the prophet Jeremiah wrote in Jeremiah 23 verse 29 that the Lord said, My word is like a fire and like a hammer that breaks the rock. I want you to note the word breaks the rock in pieces. So God's word is an instrument. It's part of His plan to bring breakthrough in your life. Therefore, for you and me to have a relationship with the Holy Spirit and through Him, the Word of God, the living Word, is actually what releases breakthrough after breakthrough in our lives. If you want the breakthrough in your life, don't focus primarily on the problem. Focus your attention on saying, Lord, what is your Word to me in this situation? Develop a relationship of love and hunger for the Word of God, that you will eat it and engage with it on a daily basis. I think it needs for us to engage on two levels. We need the written Word, the Bible in our lives. We need to read the Word daily. And not necessarily hours and hours, but just to read until there's something that grips your spirit and then meditate on it, eat it, and let it sink into your heart. But then secondly, that we will act on what God says, that we will pursue to put into action whatever He says by His Word and His Spirit in our hearts. I found that one of the greatest changes in my life came the day I received the insight that the Word is a living person and I need to build a relationship with the living Word by spending time in the Word and then being diligent to apply it in my life. I was thinking about two occasions just where there was clear-cut breakthrough from people putting the word that the Lord spoke into action. The first one was Peter and the miraculous catch of fish. And these famous words were penned that Jesus said, Peter, throw out your nets on the other side. That's after they toiled the whole night and, and caught nothing. And Jesus said, put out your nets on the other side. And Peter said these words, Lord, we've worked hard the whole night, but at your word, we will do it. And as they threw the nets overboard, on the other side, on the word of the Lord, they had a miraculous catch of fish, more than what they could handle. These same words were echoed by Jesus' mother at the wedding feast of Cana, when they ran out of wine, and they turned to her to say, well, what can we do? And, and to Jesus, what now the wine's finished? And she said, whatever he says to you, do it. I want you to know that God will help you to break through. If you have that attitude towards his word, that whatever he says to you, do it. So I encourage you, if you want to see breakthrough, love God's word, read God's word, do God's word. Remember, it's not those who study His Word or those who admire His words, but those who do His Word that sees breakthrough. And I pray that you will experience the full force of that hammer called His Word to break through for you in your life. God bless you as you do whatever He says.